Jokes about Father's Day. Getting my dad socks for Father's Day is kind of a double-edged sword. Because on one hand he gets socks, but on the other hand he's reminded where he should have come. <laughs> Father's Day is like sunburn. The darker your skin, the less likely you are to experience it. <laughs> what does Father's Day and poaching native Australian wildlife have in common? Robert Irwin doesn't celebrate it. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I love you, Rob. Oh, God. Father's Day is like sex. Dad doesn't get it anymore. <laughs> Father's Day is like an intelligent opinion. Non-existent in the Kardashian household. What do you call a loving father on Father's Day? Yeah, I don't know either. Uh, I asked my dad what he wants for Father's Day and he said, surprise me! So I'm gonna tell him I'm straight. Uh, Father's Day, uh, yeah. Uh, hard to find a car park at Mum's house. <laughs> Ah, Father's Day, or as Sigmund Freud calls it, National Cock Blockers Day. Uh, this is my impression of the CEO of Lynx Africa Gift Packs if he finds out that Father's Day has been cancelled. <coughs> Fuck! Uh, last Father's Day, uh, I skateboarded to a Father's Day lunch, and on the way there, I fell off and I broke my arm. So I called Dad and told him that I wasn't going to be able to make lunch and he said, that's okay mate, accidents happen, otherwise we wouldn't be having lunch today. <laughs> Do you reckon Father's Day in Dandenong is just another are you okay day? Um, I'd just like to wish a happy Father's Day to my dad and all the men I've called daddy since he left in 2016. <laughs> Hey, before you scroll, we tour this show all over Australia. Go to comedyuntamed.com for tickets. All right, keep scrolling, you weirdo.